problems, infinity times two is technically still bigger than infinity. Technically? No, that statement is technically and mathematically wrong. It is wrong because talking about twice infinity makes no mathematical sense. Infinity is not a number that we can work with as if it was the number 3, 7, or pi. It's just not a number. We say that a collection of elements is infinite if the number of elements in that set is larger than any finite set. So it is infinite if it is not finite. And that is just a concept and not a number that we can work with as if it was a usual number. And working with it as a number leads to all sorts of contradictions. But for the sake of the argument, let's try to come up with a model where twice infinity is just equal to infinity, to the same infinity. Take, for example, the even numbers, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, etc. These form an infinite set, and they are what we call a countable infinite set because they can be enumerated. They can be put in one-to-one -one correspondence with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 with the natural numbers. And because there are just as many even numbers as there are natural numbers, and there are as many natural numbers as there are even numbers, they have the same type of infinity, the even numbers and all the natural numbers. Now take the odd numbers, 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, etc. These can also be put in one-to-one -one correspondence with the natural numbers, and therefore they also have the same type of infinity. So now we have two sets, the even numbers and the odd numbers, that have the same type of infinity. So what happens if we do the union of the two sets? What happens if we do infinity plus infinity or twice infinity? That if we put together the even numbers and the odd numbers, then we get all the natural numbers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So we get all of them. So the union of these two infinite sets is the natural numbers, which is an infinite set, but it's the same type of infinity. So in this case, we've shown that infinity plus infinity or twice infinity equals infinity. It's not larger than in infinity is twice infinity is infinity. But again, I want to emphasize that talking about twice infinity is just nonsensical. And in fact, we've reached to an equation that says two infinity equals infinity, and therefore infinity is zero, which makes absolutely no sense. Because as I said, working with infinity as if it was a number leads to all sorts of problems. And finally, I want to mention that there are other sets like the real numbers, the sets of all decimal expansions, that are really a larger type of infinity. These numbers I cannot enumerate. I can't write a correspondence, a one-to-one correspondence between real numbers and natural numbers, and therefore the real numbers are truly a larger type of infinity.